The left is not embarrassed about what they want. They tell it outright, they tell everybody who wants to listen, they write books about it, they explain it. So when, when there was a debate about Obamacare, the left told us that what they want is single payer, universal health care, they want socialized medicine. And they said, yeah, we'll take Obamacare, it's a compromise on the way. One Republican, one, just one conservative who would say, my goal is 100% private health care. I don't want the government spending one dime on health care. That means eliminating Medicare and Medicaid so the government is out of the business of health care once and for all. That's my goal. I know I can't achieve it, so you know, I'm willing to compromise on the way. One conservative who says that. If you don't have a vision, if you don't know where you're going, if you don't believe in the goal, if you don't understand that free markets are good, you'll never win. The left has had the vision for universal health care for a hundred years. And they told us that. And every time they pass a little legislation, it would, it's with that in mind, and they tell us that. And we ignore it in our own peril. And we refuse, refuse to present an alternative vision. And it is the vision thing. Remember the vision thing with George Bush, the elder? It is the vision thing, and we don't have a vision. And as long as we don't have a vision that we're willing to defend, that we're willing to stand up for, that we're willing to fight for in principle, we lose because they have it. They've got them on high ground, and they're winning. They're winning even by just by converting the Republican Party into a far le more leftist party than it used to be. Thank you all.